Will Smith, the action star with comic snap and dramatic chops, is a box office dominator. He holds the record for the most back-to-back 100 million plus movies at the domestic box office. 8. He's played the lead in 29 films for an astounding aggregate of $6.5 billion worldwide. In this video, we are going to tell you about Will Smith's top 10 movies. The video is going to be amazing, so make sure you stick to the end. 10. Concussion In Concussion, Smith delivered a rare, dramatic turn in this real-life story of Nigerian-born forensic pathologist Dr. Bennett Omalu who, after conducting an autopsy on an NFL football player who suffered a fatal heart attack at the young age of 50, comes to the conclusion that the player also suffered severe brain damage from repeated blows to the head, a condition that Dr. Omalu labels CTE. Smith delivers a mixture of sensitivity and outrage as Dr. Omalu and tracks on convincing Nigerian accent to boot. And for his performance in Concussion, Smith earned a Golden Globe nomination for Best Actor. 9. Men in Black Franchise Smith and initially Tommy Lee Jones are the two government agents dressed in black, the sci-fi version of the Blues Brothers, and their job is to combat aliens while covering up evidence of their existence, erasing witnesses' memories with a special wand. The place of shame is occupied by the dismal Forkwell Men in Black. International 2009, in which the thrill had gone. Next is the low morale immediate follow-up Men in Black 2, 2002. Oddly, Men in Black 3, 2012, was rather better with Josh Brolin pepping things up. But the original and best is Men in Black, 1997, in which Smith was in his box office golden age as the funny, wacky, charismatic Hollywood lead. 8. Bad Boys for Life It's an impressive feat that Bad Boys for Life managed to earn over $150 million more than its predecessor, as that significant increase is more than just inflation, the return of the odd couple detective team was more than welcomed by fans, and it became the highest grossing Hollywood movie of 2020. But there's an asterisk next to that achievement. Bad Boys for Life got lucky, as it was released right before COVID-19 became a worldwide pandemic. 7. Six Degrees of Separation before Will Smith became an action movie star in the late 1990s and an Oscar-nominated dramatic performer in the 2000s, he was known for his free-wheeling antics on TV's Fresh Prince of Bel-Air and chart-topping music as one part of hip-hop's duo DJ Jazzy Jeff and the Fresh Prince. Fred Shapisi's Six Degrees of Separation allows Smith to wield his infinite charm as a con man who seamlessly integrates himself into the New York elite society through a willy intelligence and beaming smile. The character he plays is based on the true story of David Hampton, a con artist who convinced a number of people in the 1980s that he was the son of actor Sidney Poitier. 6. Aladdin after taking time off from acting, Will Smith had what he called one of the greatest experiences of his professional career in 2019's huge hit, Aladdin. The latest in a wave of live-action Disney remakes, it made over a billion dollars worldwide. Affirming Smith's status as an all-time box office draw, Smith was reluctant to take the role of the genie, given Robin Williams' memorable role in the animated original, but his son Jaden urged him to try. Smith noted that Williams brought a lot of his stand-up act and energy into the original role, so he made it his own by leaning on his hip-hop roots. The film CGI was heavily criticized in its first preview, and Vox's Asia Romano described the effects as lackluster. Still, critics like CNN's Brian Lowry's described it as a great deal of fun, and audiences worldwide seem to agree. 5. Hitch the 2005 romantic comedy Hitch stars Will Smith as date doctor Alex Hitch Hitchens, a man who makes a living teaching men how to successfully woo women. When the smooth-talking Hitch falls for the cynical columnist Sarah Millis, he discovers that his seemingly foolproof game doesn't work on the writer. The film co-stars Eva Mendes and Sarah and Kevin James as the shy accountant Albert, whom Hitch takes on as a client. 
Will Smith serves up some major charm and humor for the rom-com flick, which was a hit with audiences and raked in over $350 million. The Herald Sun praised the actor for taking on the role, proclaiming Will Smith's first ever rom-com. Needless to say, the versatile star was up to the job at the first time of asking. The romantic comedy genre is often lacking in diversity, and that's what makes Hitch such a knockout for moviegoers. Its leads are an African-American and Cuban-American, and is refreshing for audiences to see a powerful interracial couple. 4. The Legend of Bagger Vans in 2016, Will Smith played a desperate broken man visited by mysterious spiritual guides in Collateral Beauty. Perhaps he chose that role because after playing a mysterious spiritual guide in Legend of Bagger Vance, he wanted to see what it was like on the other side. Will Smith stars in the title role for his Robert Redford directed fantasy about a golfer desperate for a comeback, Matt Damon, who puts his game and his life back together with the help of a magic caddy. The Legend of Bagger Vance is an inspiring feel-good movie that sees Smith playing way out of type for the time that is. 3. The Pursuit of Happiness the Pursuit of Happiness was released in 2006, and along with the nomination as one of the best American biographical drama films, the amazing film is directed by one of the finest directors, Gabriel Messino. In this movie, Will Smith performs as Chris Gardner. The story moves around a homeless salesman. In this movie, Smith's son makes his film debut, known as Jaden Smith Stars. Moreover, performs a role as the son of Gardner Christopher Jr., Stephen Conrad's screenplay, the blockbuster memoir, is based on 2006 of the identical name which Gardner wrote with Quincy Troop. It is a detailed story written and directed on Gardner's struggle for almost a year to be homeless. 2. Independence Day Smith's first genuine blockbuster, Roland Emmerich's Alien Invasion epic Independence Day grossed over $300 million dollars in the U.S. alone and helped to cement Smith's status as a major box office draw. In Independence Day, Smith plays Captain Stephen Hiller and Marine Corps' F.A. 18 fighter pilot, who is in the thick of the fight against aliens who have come to invade and take over Earth via their enormous spacecraft. Independence Day marked the first time that Smith was the leading player in a large star-filled ensemble and the international box office success of Independence Day helped Smith to become a star all over the world. 1. Hancock Hancock saw Smith's first attempt at getting in on the superhero trend fairly early on, but there's an interesting twist to the genre. The movie follows superhero John Hancock, who is an alcoholic and often causes millions of dollars worth of damages. The city holds the hero accountable for his actions. So, Though it was negatively received, the movie was way ahead of its time, tackling the same moral dilemmas of Captain America. Civil War would eight years later. Hancock's box office result is one of the best examples of how bankable Smith was in the 2000s, as the film is one of the few superhero movies that isn't actually based on any existing property. Let us know your opinion in the comments section below. This was all for today. Hope you liked the video. Do not forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel.